So this apple pie recipe is a little different than your typical apple pie recipe, but it is one of my absolute favorites and I think you're gonna like it too. Here's what you're gonna need. Seven to eight apples, peeled, cored, and sliced, half a cup of honey, one teaspoon of thyme, half a cup of brown sugar, six tablespoons of flour, half a teaspoon of ginger, half a teaspoon of salt, and two pie crusts. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm gonna unroll my pie crust and place it in my pie plate. I'm using a frozen pie crust because it's easier, but if you wanna make your own pie crust, that's great, go right ahead. Uh, then I'm gonna poke some holes in the bottom of it here, so that way it won't get poofy in the oven, and I'm gonna pre-bake it for about 10 minutes. Now, if you want to, you can line it with foil and place beans or rice or pie weights in it, but I was not prepared. So, it's going in the oven just like this. Then the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna peel, core, and slice all my apples using my magic apple core peeler slicer thingamajigger. Throw those into a bowl. We're ready to make a pie filling. Next, we're going to bring our honey to a boil. All right, once you've got it to a nice boil, then we're gonna add in our thyme. Just sprinkle that in. And then we're gonna add in our apples. And I'm just gonna slowly add those in because we don't want these to cook through. We just wanna coat them with the honey and thyme and um, just make them change color just a little bit. So this is my absolute favorite pie recipe. I learned how to make this at a local bakery where they were doing a pie making class with my mom and my sister and we had just an absolute blast. So once the apples are all coated with our honey and thyme and they've changed color just a little bit, just a tiny bit. We're gonna take them off the heat, and then in a separate bowl, we're gonna add in our flour, brown sugar, ginger, and salt. And we're gonna mix that together. We've got all that mixed together, and then we're gonna add in our apples. And once again, get them all coated. And feel free to try a slice, it's delicious, I promise. So once you've got that all coated, then we're gonna take our pie crust and fill that up. Apples cook down. So if you end up with a very tall pie, it's okay. Then you're going to take your other pie crust and place it right on top. Pinch it in, poke some holes in the top so that it'll vent. All right, so after you poke the holes in the top, then what we're going to do is take some butter and just brush it on top. And then sprinkle some sugar. So after you've done all that, then it's ready to go in the oven and it'll stay in there for about an hour or until the juices are really thick. And after about an hour, you can take it out and it's ready to go. Voila! Thank you guys so much for watching. And to make sure you don't miss a single recipe, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you next time.